Hello YouTubers and Disney Cars fans, and before we get to the meat and potatoes of this episode, which as you read the title, is some pretty good stuff, but I forgot to do something on my last video, which I'm recording them right after, so yeah, so I forgot to compare these guys um, together with um, the metallic deco. So, the metallic deco ones on the right, and if you didn't see my last video, I was actually able to get the K-Day case early. I found it at Kmart, so yeah, so I did a review. And so, as you can see, this is a normal version of Ripley Chauncey with the orange, and then they just made it gold, so that's the only difference. Sorry, I did show it to you on the last video. And I'll just show you, uh, Miguel Camino, they use the same kind of gold paint on him as they used on uh, Rip, as you can see, it's pretty much the same. So now let's get to the, um, oh, by the way, I also had this in my video, the um, Chrome Lightning McQueen. So let's get to the cars of the day. So I was able to find at a Walmart some remnants of Case Q, and that is um, Luigi and Guido with shaker and glasses, which obviously uh, it's got um, just Luigi in there as nothing really, and um, just some accessory glasses. And then Guido's got the shaker with the little bow tie too. Nice little thing on the front there, a nice representation. On the back here, we got some other um, Wheel Well Motel cars, including them. Probably this series probably wasn't the best for people. I mean, I know the only other one that people may buy is this Body Shop Ramon and Waiter Mater, which uh, is a deluxe. And so, yeah, let's get this guy opened up, or these guys opened up. So, yeah, I found um, some of these remnants at a uh, Walmart. I was really happy to find them because I know many people have been finding these um, cars, and I have not. So, yeah. Ugh. Okay. Here's uh, Luigi. Of course, it's the same as previously released, only now he's got a... Oops, sorry. Focusing problems. Only now he's kind of this black outline around his eyes, but pretty much the same. Nice to have an extra Luigi if we... Um, let's just focus on the license plate here. There you go. 445108. Pretty cool. I like Luigi. He's always a nice model to collect. Let's take a um, look at the uh, uh, margarita glasses or... Um, whatever they're called. So yeah, they got a little something something in there, and of course they're all stuck together. But I uh, really like that they put an accessory in here and just, um, instead of just making it the, the um, Guido and Luigi, they put these glasses in there. Which is very true, because Filmer and Sarge and Luigi were waiting as a Guido took the shaker and then opened it up and spread it into these three glasses and then shoved it over to his customers. So just taking a look at that. Nice uh, translucent plastic. Yep. So here is the uh, Guido with the shaker. And so th that's pretty cool, I think. I like him. And, of course, he has a little bow tie, bow tie just like Waiter Mater does. And, of course, his forks, or his forks are positioned to hold the shaker. And, yeah, nice expression. Pretty nice. I uh, really like that. Just kind of reminds me of the the um, time where they released the other pack with the um, Lu um, Luigi and Guido with paint rollers and stuff. So let's uh, take another closer look. And then, yeah, so I'll show them on the turntable at the end of the video. But uh, now we got to get to um, Mildred Bylane, which she is pretty heavy. Definitely indeed. So, yeah, the store had... Two of the Guido and Luigi's and just one Mildred, which I was completely um, completely happy with. I just now need to go find those chases. So, yeah, Mildred Bylane, pretty cool. Um, of course, she was in the first movie, um, Retro Radiator Spring Series. This is the first car I ever bought out of this Retro Radiator Spring Series because I already have all the other ones. Don't necessarily need to buy them again. I love the little picture they have on the back here. Very cool, in my opinion. Because, yeah, I already got these when they were released originally. And now the only new car that they had in the series was Mildred. Love the little uh, picture of her in the front there. So, yeah, very heavy. So, let's get her ripped open. Ah, so hard to open these guys to 
today. Ah oh, man. Sorry about this guys, it's taking a little bit. Here we go, clean cut. Here we go. Yeah, she's got a lot of metal in there because all this part right here is metal. So yeah, she's got a nice hefty weight to her. So yeah, she's got a nice grill on the front there and uh, her eyes are looking to the uh, left there. I think I need to rewatch the movie to kind of see where exactly she was, but I do remember her. Got a nice white stripe there with the nice kind of gold paint job. Very cool. Pretty cool model. And the license plate reads 2769. There we go. And so now let's put these guys on the turntable. So these will also be available at K-Day if you do not find them. So that's good for you guys because I know... Um, if Sorry about that, guys. Stupid me accidentally cut the video instead of focusing in on the uh, car. But uh, let me just adjust the camera there. And let's get uh, back to Mildred. So as I said... Um, uh, I was, if you don't find her now, she's kind of thin in the back and then gets a little bit more broad in the front. But yeah, if you don't find her now, you'll be able to find her, um, at K-Day because she'll be two in, per case. And same thing with Luigi and Guido with martini and glasses. And so yeah, sorry about that cut. It really sucked because now I have to edit my video. And so yeah. That's Mildred there. Sorry about the screeching noise. I cannot control that. But here's Luigi and Guido with shaker and glasses. Um, let's focus in on uh, Guido and then let's put the glasses in there too. So those are really cool models. Really, very cool. So yeah, thank you guys for watching this video. Hope you enjoyed it. And um, so now I just need to find the, the chases. Um, the the th three, no, two, two chases that they uh, released. So thank you guys for watching, hope you enjoyed this video, and I'll see you guys next time.